What's going on guys? Welcome back to Arcway, a new direction of the modern man. In today's video, I'm going to share with you guys the reasons why and how I apply Jamaican black castor oil into my beard. So I'm going to break down the benefits of it and I'll show you guys how I exactly do it. So if you're a young gentleman that wants to improve your hair growth with long-term longevity, the length, the width, the thickness of your beard, make sure you guys subscribe down to the section down below. I'll post more content on this. What's going on guys? Welcome back to Arcway, a new direction of the modern man. And today's video, I'm gonna show you guys why applying Jamaican castor oil is gonna be the most beneficial thing for your guys' health. Okay, now I'm gonna break down some components of Jamaican castor oil, and also I'm gonna give you a little history of Jamaican castor oil. So Jamaican castor oil came from Africa, so it comes from the castor oil bean. So essentially, this is the property of where this essentially derived from. So over time, it got shipped over to Jamaica where it was more or less manufactured and brewed out there. And that being said, I'm gonna show you guys some benefits of Jamaican castor oil. So one of the biggest benefits of Jamaican castor oil is that it's a great moisturizer. If you're looking to moisturize your beard, if you experience dryness, if you experience itchiness, especially for me, I experience itchiness under my beard or dryness, especially when I used to be young, a little younger, I experienced a lot of dryness under there, so I applied Jamaican castor oil when I was very young to this day, I, and it helped me actually moisturize the beard a lot more easier and actually had the components to actually make it more softer. So if you're looking to hydrate your beard, it's a good way to start. The second thing is the strengthening of the beard. The strength of the beard is gonna be the overall health of the beard. So you want your beard to be strong, you want it to be moisturized, you want it to stay healthy. So this will actually prevent long-term breakage and actually produce a, like stronger follicles in your hair. So Jamaican castor oil has the components to not only boost up your testosterone, but it also helps you with strengthening your beard follicles. So if you want to strengthen your beard, Jamaican castor oil, extra dark is the way to go. The next thing is it stimulates your beard growth. So when it comes down to stimulating your beard on a micro level and a macro level, the micro level, all the small hair follicles that you kind of don't see or you kind of experience patchiness with, applying Jamaican castor oil over time was actually gonna help you benefit you, especially when it comes down to producing hair follicles for long-term longevity and your health. And on a macro level is when you get the bigger beard. So if you guys want something like that, applying Jamaican castor oil into your routine is gonna be beneficial. So I'll give you guys a little story about me applying Jamaican castor oil is that when I was about 16, applying Jamaican castor oil was actually very beneficial and it was actually the moment in time where I started realizing and seeing the growth as I got more of a full beard. I didn't get a full beard until I was like 21. So if you guys are in that stage and you haven't grown a full beard, don't sweat it. It's gonna come with time. So I basically started applying Jamaican castor oil into my beard and it just helped me stimulate the hair follicles and hair growth. Even though over time it shows maybe the first two months, it's, it's a slow process, but over time, this is gonna be beneficial. So I need you guys to start working out. I need you guys to start taking better care of your health and using these components to enhance the experience. So first thing first, take care of yourself first and then start applying these type of things to enhance the experience. If you guys are interested in applying Jamaican castor oil into your routine, make sure to check out the links down below. I show all the descriptions of what I use and exactly where you can get it so you guys can just source it out and purchase it for yourself or someone for a gift. So one thing I can recommend you guys when it comes on Jamaican castor oil is that using Jamaican castor oil for like a deep conditioning. So if you guys have like a hairnet or like you use a hairnet for your beard, applying Jamaican castor oil into the beard at least once a week and then at the same time, leave it in for like 30 minutes, 30 or 40. And after that, go into the shower, you know, wash it off or whatever. And then you'll experience your beard being a lot more stimulated and a lot more softer. That way, the natural oils of the component of the Jamaican castor oil will kind of go into your skin a lot more and it will kind of embrace the habits of what you're creating. So now I'm going to show you guys how I apply Jamaican castor oil into my beard and what it takes massaging it into your beard so that way it can actually have a deep down conditioning of your beard so it moisturizes your skin but also your hair follicles so that most importantly after that pick it out with my hair or my hair pick and and after that I actually kind of style it with my hand and after that is pretty much 
how I complete my process. So if you guys want to see more content regarding this, I did post a video regarding applying tea tree oil and Jamaican castor oil into one. So if you want to see that combination video, you guys check it up right there. I show you guys the breakdown and the benefits of both. And if you guys want to see more content just like this one, make sure you guys subscribe in the section down below. I'm posting daily content for you guys. So that way you guys can stay updated and you guys can know what's going on with Arcway. Hit the notification bell, most importantly. Check out the IG page and I'll see you guys in the next video. So yet again, guys, thank you guys so much for watching Arcway, A New Direction of a Modern Man. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.